Volvo creates living seawall to combat plastic pollution. Mangrove trees anchor 75% of coastlines in the tropics, providing habitats for ocean life. But according to the World Wildlife Federation, more than 35% of the world's mangrove trees have disappeared in the last half century. Volvo is working on what it calls living seawalls, which mimic the structure of mangrove roots to recreate habitats for marine life that were once supported by mangrove trees. It is building one living seawall in Sydney, Australia, where half of the coastline is now comprised of artificial seawalls. Volvo is working with the Sydney Institute of Marine Science and Reef Design Lab to build the living seawall, which will be made up of a total of 50 3D printed tiles. The tiles will be reinforced with recycled plastic fibers. These tiles are designed to mimic the root structure of native mangrove trees in Sydney, and it is hoped they will provide a habitat for marine life that was lost when mangrove forests gave way to artificial coastlines. According to Volvo's website, the artificial seawall will be able to attract filter-feeding organisms, which will aid in absorbing and filtering out toxic pollutants. The living seawall will be installed on the existing seawall structure in Sydney Harbour. According to the UN, humans produce around 300 million tons of plastic waste every year. Australians produce 3 million tons of plastic every year, of which only 12% is recycled, according to WWF Australia. According to EcoWatch, items such as plastic water bottles, grocery bags, and straws all end up in the ocean on a daily basis. Volvo says researchers will observe the seawall for the next 20 years as it improves biodiversity and water quality.